What's up everyone, welcome back to the channel. We're doing a quick look into Saitama and what are the big boys doing? Flip the negative on its head and look at the positive side of the coin and that is that it's a great opportunity to buy. Um, I have not sold any of my tokens. I believe in this uh, project long term. But let's get straight into this video. So we take a look at the chart for Saitama. This is a 12 hour chart from kind of middle, uh, sorry, the early part of January, where we have seen a significant drop off in terms of price down at the 2274s. I'm not sure people thought it would get this low again. $10.4 million in terms of daily volume. So there is still some volume going through Saitama right now. 14.3 million in liquidity doesn't feel great. 1.2 billion. This could drop below a billion dollar market cap if we are not careful. So there's been lots of talk and lots of kind of viewpoints on this. When you kind of go through the Saitama YouTube, everyone is kind of out there giving their opinion on it. Zach Humphries is out there. Austin Hilton's out there. And what are they saying? That's the big question. What are they saying right now? Well, look, I think we can all agree that the Cider Mask launch has not launched exactly how they expected it to. We are on version 1.8 as of right now. And still, we find that over 50% of the community cannot log in. Now, the trouble with this is it is starting to damage the brand, in my opinion. In my opinion. And we've sort of seen very little in terms of the dev team, very little from kind of uh, Russ and, and the rest of the kind of team over at Saitama. They're just not coming out and saying anything. But the point of the video, what are the big boys doing? Well, look, you listen to Zach Humphries, you listen to Austin Hilton. Those guys are holding strong with their tokens. If anything they are increasing their positions or certainly are talking about it. And this phrase of buying the dip, costing uh, dollar cost average, is kind of really relevant in some respects. Now, again, it's not financial advice and only afford to invest what you can afford to lose. But their point and their sentiment is kind of, you know, it's pretty good advice. Um, so, you know, if you're going to dollar cost average this, if you're, you know, as an example, if you bought in on the all time high, okay, but you are then can load some more up in this, you're going to bring that price down. Therefore, the gains that you need to make are less. Again, not financial advice, but Austin is holding strong long term. And I talk about this on my channel. It is a long term hold for me, Saitama. The potential is there. Once they get the app up and running, we'll definitely see some volume come back in. Right now, people are scared. People will have, and we can't deny this, people will have overstretched themselves in terms of investment because this thing had an unbelievable amount of hype attached to it. Now, when we look at the total crypto market, 1.61 trillion down another 9% on the day is a huge red bull bloodbath. Bitcoin down at 35.2, which is an unbelievable price to get in. But look, Ethereum down at 2.5K. So not only... Are you not getting as many tokens for your Ethereum? But Ethereum is absolutely tanking as well. And look, as you go through the market, every token, barring a couple, are red. You know, the whole market is really having a not a great time. Now, when you think about it, there is inflation, there is cost of livings going up, there is potential issues in terms of mining in Russia, lots of problems in the globe right now that, you know, cryptocurrency is just that bit too risky for a lot of people so a lot of people are pulling their volumes out and i think you can see exactly the same trend into saitama when we look across the entire DeFi space you know shirio down 25 percent mononoke which you know people have opinions on that the rest of them are down 10 percent shinja down 23 and a half percent so the whole kind of DeFi market is down but look what are the big boys doing what are the people that made a lot of money in crypto doing they're holding strong with their saitama tokens i for one i'm doing exactly the same i haven't held it i haven't sold the token since this and look, if you believe in a long-term project and you haven't put money in that you can't afford to lose, then do you know what? What have we got to lose right now? Remember this. You only lose money when you sell. That's right. You only lose money when you sell. I want to reiterate that. So if you don't sell anything, you need to see it as you haven't lost money. This will come back and it will come back with a vengeance, I believe, because we've got lots of tokens going on it. You think the usability of the token isn't there. They could have not released this and we would still be in exactly the same situation as where we are now. Even to the fact that it's on the test net for some people, some people are moving money, transferring tokens, seed phrases, all of that is on the blockchain. So it's not going to go missing. But right now you cannot use the Satamask app. But more and more people are getting on it. We were at 80% nearly a week ago, 50% this morning. So certainly it feels like it's getting there. We're starting to get more usability and then we will start to see some onboarding of tokens. I think right now we've just got to try it. But when you look at the big boys, they are holding strong, keeping their tokens, not selling. And again, never sell in a bear market, in my opinion, unless you absolutely have to. If anything, it's all about trying to dollar cost average, increase your bottom floor price to try and make those gains a little bit less so you can make more money when you get the opportunity. But let me know what you think in the comments down below. Are you still holding strong or have you sold out? And I'll see you in the next one.